We join you in Terence's 8 feet cheap apartment. My god, that guy has to get a life. Yeah. Alright, Cable News, entertain me now. <laughs> Welcome back to Nature 101. We join you with the elusive rare bird, Tabu Coco as it joins its south migration to northern climate. Tabo Coco's amazing ability to touch the sky in amazing ways. Any human wants to have the experience to touch the sky as this amazing bird have. Now that includes another episode of Nature 101. Now take up your wings and fly like Tabu Coco. Woo! Wow, that show is inspirational. Why am I here sitting here? I have to join Tabu Coco in the sky, and then I will truly see things with a different eye. Uh, uh, to the sky! Hey Terrence, what's up? Um, they... Is there some weird holiday like you stand on top of a TV then look into the sky? Because that holiday sounds awesome. This holiday is pretty awesome. But seriously, what are we doing up here? I'm gonna invent a flying machine. Wait, how the... Uh, and I'm gonna take inspiration from the great birds up above. Behold Fuffikins, the great wall of flight. Um, Terence, what are we getting at? Simple Fuffikins, I'm gonna invent a flying machine. Alright Fuffikins, now I'm gonna fly. Um, Terence, what are you gonna do? Well Fuffikins, I modified my car to fly. I use LED-FDR technology to make my car a flying machine. Let me guess, you take two wings from the dump, then hot glue them to your car and expect it to fly? What do you mean? Well, good luck with your death trap. Oh, I will, Fuffikins, I will. Wish me luck! <laughs> Maybe I haven't thought this through. Ah! You okay, Terrence? No! You okay, Terrence? Yeah! Thank God I'm a Lego! Or I would just break more than three ribs. Some tells me I crash landed in old man Jenkins' weed farm. I'm sick and tired of these set of folk and their flying machines! No kid! We better listen to what he says, Fuffikins. He knows how to grow food! Yeah, no one else on the planet could do that. Am I right? Meanwhile, at Mount Free. Um, Terrence, what? Tell me why we're doing on this mountain again? Isn't it obvious, Fuffikins? Today I fly, fly, fly. Don't worry, Fuffikins. I bought these um gliders at an auction shop a day, and these will fly. Good luck, might get killed. To the sky! Excuse me, sir. Yeah, how I, I like to return these gliders. What's your problem, mate? Trust me, you don't want to know. Okay, but you look familiar. What do you mean? You're that guy from the news report. What news report? I'm Joey Patoli, and we're on breaking news. Um. A city boy named Terence President has a found to be indeed crazy that he tried to fly on the edge of the Fukalhan's highest peak. Now make fun of him, ridicule him, 
and don't show him any mercy. We are going to continue filling your time with endless pictures, wasting your precious, precious time. I am Joy Patoe, signing off. Wait a minute, I'm crazy because I follow my dreams? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm not shopping here again. Hey, look, it's the bird boy of Rikalahan. Why is he still losing his legs? Very weird. Bird boy, bird boy. <laughs> this is a sad day for Callahan. While a guy is ridiculed for having dreams. Kid, you're not the only one here with unfulfilled dreams. I, I wanted to create a world well without any sin, sin, sin. But look what that got me done. I want to be an expert pianist. I think, think but I, but I finally figure out don't have any fingers. Just these stupid claws! These stupid, stupid claws! Yeah, what makes you so special? Get him! That ain't good. Ah! Mm. Maybe this would be harder than I thought. So, will Terrence learn how to fly? Find out next time on the show. To be continued.